our 13th speaker. Is a passionate researcher since her college days up until now. Currently working as public schools district supervisor, she strongly believes that it is her mission to spread the love for research to her fellow teachers. She published her book, Research, My Passion. Let's all welcome author Dr. Eden Malaba. Anyone who is experiencing problems right now? Have you been finding solutions to your problems? Please raise your hand if you are. Congratulations! Indeed, you are a great person and you will overcome them. Who are celebrating their birthdays this month? I am also going to celebrate my birthday on the 23rd of this month. And thank you for your advanced gifts. But before you are going to give me your advanced gifts, let us find an answer to this question. Is there a significant relationship between self-gift and gift from others? Let's find out. And because you inspired me a lot, I started scribble day by day, spending 35 to 40 minutes daily for a week because it is my passion. And I've been obeying grave, not my tongue. I see to it that I have to write daily, even just a paragraph or two, slowly, step by step, and repeatedly. And thanks God, I did it. Thanks, Coach Jonas Dupont and the other sources of my inspiration. Are you still listening to me? Yes, thank you. You need to pay attention to me. Why? Because I sustain your interest. Because you have to know what is research. Am I arousing your desire to go on listening to me? Thank you so much. But if not, I cannot do anything because I have already gained your action. I have already your reaction. Now, you are ready to answer the next question. Now, what is in my self-gift that can be my best gift to others? Yes, research is behind the many good things that is happening daily in our lives. Research helps us to look into the answer, to find answers to our queries. And to tell you, research is power. I repeat, research is power. And I want you to become powerful too. That's why you have to continue listening to me. If you know the essentials of research, no questions cannot be answered by you. Research is also exciting. Exciting topics can be studied about research. And what will excite you more? Sometimes the knowledge that you have, the findings that you have, might be contradictory to the findings of other researchers. Once you have started researching, who knows where will you end up? Isn't it something? You will become powerful. And since it will become your passion, it will drive you to be successful. Passion gives you the energy, gives you the effort to finish what you have started. Passion is what drives people to do more, more and more. And I salute all of you. Because as an author, you have done a lot of researching too that you may not have even noticed. Becoming a published author is both a blessing and a treasure for me. It's my self-gift on my 58th birthday. And thank you so much. Isn't it amusing? A gift for myself? Yes. Is there a significant relationship? between my self-gift and gift for others? Yes, it is highly significant 
because my self-give is to be shared to others, to multiply myself so that there will be more Eden P. Malabang. And since you listen intently, you are also now becoming not only a star but a legend. Yes, you are going to become a legend, not only a star, because great things await ahead beyond your comfort zones. Never give up, no matter what. No matter what, never give up. Please take care because you are important. To end, before I forget, may I introduce you the best friend of Ida. She is Laura. And whenever we are going to write or do something, let us remember Laura and ask these questions. Do I listen? Do I understand what I listen at? Do I analyze what I am listening at? Do I understand what I'm analyzing? Do I react to what I analyze? And do I act? Yes, you are going to act now. We are going to act now. Now, not later, because it is highly significant. Thank you, dear friends. Now, not later, because it is highly significant. Thank you, author Dr. Eden Malabang. Taking down notes, a lot of wisdom to remember.